修練場かやっぱりちょっとここだけ雰囲気が違うな修練といっても戦う場所には違いないもの誰でも腕試しさせてくれるんだろいいじゃねえか細かいこと抜きでいこうぜ Well the game crashed again because I talked to an NPC so that's not good Okay this time I'm going to give it everything I have I've been training for,、uh, for this day I know I can do it Hope so, what are we going to do if you get hurt in there? My first. My fist feels like a ball of fire. I bet I can take the advanced trials, no problem. No, no, don't get ahead of yourself, you're drunk again. Did you forget you flunked the entrance exams up for the guard? The reason your hands feel like that is because you punched a wall, dummy. I suggest you stick to the novice fights、uh, if you know what's good for you. Oh, let's not talk to that guy. He broke the game a minute ago. Welcome to the training grounds of Pride of Vicent. If you're looking for a place to take your training to the next level, you come to the right place. We embrace anybody who walks through our doors. As long as you want to improve yourself, you'll always have a place here to train. I can already tell just from looking at you all that you don't、uh, want to simply improve either. You want to be the best at what you do, right? Then step up and throw down the gauntlet. We'll be more than happy to put you through your paces. Solo battle. Okay, here, explanation. Uh, the training grounds you'll fight solo or in a group, sometimes under special rules. The difficulty is fixed to normal, and items aren't allowed. Clearing them for your first time beating your first and your time in subsequent tries earns you rewards.、Uh, some trials have special rules as listed below. Down only damage. Damage is, in, is inflicted after enemies are down by boost attack. No rematches for X amount of mins.、Uh, cannot be attempted again for the stated period. Well, let's do a solo and see what happens. Let's go in with a elephant. Elephant training. Well, I'm only level 18 still. Let's just do elephant training then, sure. All training begins at step one. Those who are brave enough to take it will find greater heights awaiting them. Now, let's get. You on the path to training. This guy's level 21. Should be okay. Right? Oh, this damage is very bad. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, we could kill him. As long as we don't get hit. There's more. Uh oh. That's not good. I think they said you can't heal either, right? Oh shit! Yeah, I don't think you're allowed to heal during this. No, you're not. But it could be the end for Alf, and then we'll have to come back later. He's got a laser? Well, I've got one HP left, so we're gonna die. Leveled for this as well at the moment, so we'll come back. We'll be back, don't worry.
Okay, let's go up here now. He's not saying anything to us now. Isn't this city so beautifully verdant? The climate is nice, but it's important that we take good care of this place. Lord Dolan wants the city's scenery to remain well-preserved. He puts so much consideration into ensuring we lead pleasant lives. Does he? Frankly, I was skeptical about coexisting with Danans, but you get used to them. You again after we parted ways, uh, an urgent petition from the citizenry came in. Lord Dolan is currently busy uh, responding to it. As such, I must ask for you to wait until he finishes his business. Once preparations are complete, I'll lead the way. Scene. Pretty fancy place they got here. There's no way this isn't a trap. Oh, this is the guy I saw on uh, one of the cover arts. Is this him? You're the wielder of the blazing sword, the li liberator of Calaglia. You dress so humbly for someone of such grandeur. But where are my manners? I am the ruler of Elde Manencia. I am Lord Dolem Il Caras. If you know who we are, then you know how strange it is to invite us into your place. I thought I'd clear up your misconceptions before things could escalate. What do you say? You did come here to defeat me, did you not? Perhaps, and what if we did? Are you planning to fight us here? I don't think that would be necessary. After all, I imagine you've taken it fair amount, taken in amount, of, a fair amount of vicent. Have you come across even one slave being abused? Soldiers killing for sport, suffering of any form? I would hazard that you have not. For I have liberated Menencia from suffering and brought joy to its people. If the results are not enough to stay your sword. That was a bit uncalled for for her to do that, I think. Commend you for your boldness, but it won't work on me. Still, your would-be assassination cannot go unpunished. Well, now you fucked it up, Shion. Okay. Fair enough, allow me to host you for dinner. We shall continue our talk then. Kelzalik. Yes, my lord. Please escort our guests if you would be so kind. Well, that was a bit dumb of her to try and fucking kill him right there. And he hasn't even done anything. That's what you get for being so careless. What? Yeah, what were you thinking attacking him on your own? Why did you attack him here? What are you upset about? A god is supposed to be overthrowing the Lord, remember? Could have been hurt. Wouldn't have been the first time either. What's gotten into you? Hey, do you know Alphen is really just worried about you, right? He's worried? I mean, that's what it looked like to me. Maybe not. Another panel. More skills. We won't upgrade them yet. I have a lot of skills to get still.
It pains me to say that Renan cuisine isn't to your liking. Uh, I asked my chef to prepare only the finest deli delicacies available. Two wasted opportunities. Why did you sit the Dunnans here free? Ah, but you were mistaken, you see. I may rule single-handedly, but on my own, even I cannot change the order of things. But what is it? What is in within my power is the welfare of the people, the fostering of a mutual respect among the classes. This I can change. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the Dunnans are still oppressed, if you ask me. Only in a sense... They continue to serve as laborers, yes. However, I assure you that they are fairly compensated for their efforts. This harmony we strive for is the current pinnacle of Ren and Danon coexistence. Harmony and coexistence between the Renans and the Danons? What about the crown contest? This doesn't exactly make you a shoe in And yet the Danons here are even more productive than what they used to face daily lives. In any case, the crown contest is of little importance to me, and even less to Eli Melencia. You see, I have no interest in becoming a sovereign. This guy plays the violin and everything, and we're trying to kill him. Stop it, please, it's over. Jesus, he killed him, I think. Yep. So that means that guy with the sword was a... Renin? Because he had the blue eyes thingy? How could you, I swear. I swear I'll never forgive you for this. I can't believe what he just did. It's not, it's not by choice that one assumes the throne or a realm. Sovereign is a different matter entirely. I have no interest in playing their games. Are you saying you'll withdraw from the contest? I guess if you don't plan to ascend the throne, there is not much reason to harvest energy for the Nanans, is there? Let the ambitious fight it out amongst themselves. All I care for is maintaining peace throughout my realm. So what, your personal desires are all that matters to you? Take a look in the mirror. I may not play their games, but you have outright betrayed your own. You've torn down two of my fellow lords. What precisely is your aim? Spare me your answer, I care not for your reasons. Suffice to say, I will not impede you. That said, should you threaten the peace of my realm, I will respond. I suggest you conclude your business and leave Menencia at your convenience. I mean, to be fair, he doesn't want trouble. I mean, he just wants the place to be peaceful and his villagers happy, so... I don't see a reason to be killing him or to really go around killing his guards or anything. 
I shall arrange for rooms for all of you at the local inn. There is a short ways down the road. You may stay there for the night, after which I suggest you promptly make your departure. Unless there's something bigger going on with this lord in the background and he's not really as nice as he seems. Uh, look at how ritzy this place is. How many rooms do you think it's got? Don't you think you're being a little too relaxed? They could strike us at any moment. If they're going to attack us, they would have done it already. Well, Shion, you tried to kill the lord just there, so... I don't really blame them if they attack you. Look at this, though. This is a fancy damn area. So you're the blazing sort of Calagri now, huh? Come to think of it, I remember Ganabel calling you that as well. Yeah, you're getting the, you're getting to be pretty famous among the lords. Yeah, that's not a good thing either. What do you mean? That's something you should be proud of, if anything. Alfin, they're scared of you, man. You're a real badass. It's not as simple as that, Law. The more well-known he is, the more people might come after him. No, that's not what I'm worried about. It isn't? When people call me that, it feels like there's something hanging over me that shouldn't be there. It's hard to put into words, but it's something that doesn't feel like a part of me. Something I can't let be a part of me, or else. Hmm, well, I think it's pretty amazing, but that's just me. So we can only go into two of these rooms, is it? She's got to clean this whole entire place with just that one feather duster. She's going to be here for a while. Stay at the inn. Can we go into any of the rooms? I don't I don't think it matters, does it? The barracks. Oh, there's probably some goodies in here though. Well there's an apple. Hey, it's your turn to patrol now. Okay, time to get out there and make Lord Dolan proud. What do you think you're doing even when you're a guard but nobody seriously expects you to sleep in your... Oh, good grief. Okay, didn't say I don't... Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, there's not really much in here. Just an apple. Entrance plaza, staff quarters. I heard that our ancestors used to be able to read and write, but we all forgot how to do it. Yep, but look at, look at you now dispensing medicine like a pro. There's nothing I can't learn from reading books, and once I figured out how to write, I started recording what I learned for future reference. So thankful to Lord Do and Lim for giving me so many wonderful chances to learn and improve myself. We have so much to be grateful for. If it wasn't for Lord Do and Lim, we wouldn't be able to live together like this despite being unrelated. Yeah, you're right. I'm so glad to have you, sis. You feel so warm and soft. Somebody's getting sleepy, I think. It's bedtime. Uh, the selection of books on etiquette, the titles alone, make your posture go rigid. There's something hidden behind here. Found a hastily scrawled note. Uh, commerce with Mahagsar. Oh, commerce with Mahagsar grows more. Inscrutable by the day, we send vast quantities of resources but only receive a pittance of dodgy goods in return. Is his lordship aware of this? So what is Maharsar? 
One of the five realms of Dana from the sound of it, Kel's outlook had something to do with him. You sure are working hard. You sure are working hard for a young boy your age. That's because my dad collapsed working in the quarry. He's recovering in a medical facility, so I better have to take. So I have to take over for him until he gets better. That's real big of you. I should send the young guy who sleeps on the job to talk to you. Maybe then they'll take the work seriously. Entrance plaza, meeting room, dining hall. Oh my god, this place is fucking huge. Jesus. So many areas. Holy crap. Any goodies in here? A lemon? This guy's having a nap. They're all having a nap. This guy's just posing. Okay, nothing really in here at all. Nothing in there. Uh, meeting room. Everyone was asleep. The Lord's quarters. Does that mean Doalim's gonna be in there if it's the Lord's quarters? This is Lord Dolan's private quarters. Yeah, I figured we can't go in there. The treasury. It's locked. Okay, never mind. We can't go in there. The guard room. Did we go in there? I can't remember. Sorry, I can't let anyone into the Lord's chamber at a prior appointment. I'm going to have to ask you all to leave. The guard room. Uh, it's an array of guarded weaponry. Of guard weaponry, it appears to be quite well maintained. Pork bun recipe. A slice of cubed pork belly in a springy wheat bun. One bite is the, of the moist meat poking out is enough to send any hungry eater into euphoria. I figured out... I figured the only books Kisara would have on her shelves would be about combat, but I also found cookbooks and fishing books in her room. Gee, I wonder what got her interested in those things. The best of offense is a good shield, an illustrated guide to shields. Shields Historia, whoever owns these books, sure likes shields. This isn't Kisara's room though, is it? Oh, maybe it is. Whatever you think... Whatever you all think of him personally, we guardsmen have sworn an oath. Of loyalty to serve and protect Lord Dohalim. Anyone who attempts to disturb the peace and stability that our Lord has worked so hard to realize shall be met with no mercy. No, we're not allowed in there either, okay. Well, maybe we will go out then to the uh, the entrance plaza. Because we've been in all the other rooms now.
Did I go in here? I can't remember. I did. The office? Do we go in the office? Can we go in the office? This door is tightly shut. No, we can't. We can go in there, though. Any goodies? Uh, the inn that we have reserved for you is straight down the road once you leave the palace. Do not make his excellently regret this generosity. Are you sure this is such a good idea, good idea sir Kelzalik? Do you not realize that our guests are still here? We'll have this conversation later. Oh, they're talking uh, shit about us behind our back. Hey, isn't my meal ready for... Isn't my meal ready yet or what? I'm sorry, we're still fixing it. Great, I'm still wa waiting on that per paperwork I asked for too. Terribly sorry, I'll go check on what's happening with that right away. Nothing in here. Oh, another door. Okay, so we will have to go out then to the, uh, to the entrance plaza. Oh my god, look at all these areas in here. Probably not anything here though, is there? So far we've only got a bit of apple gel and a lemon. Peach gel. Lord Dolem sure is an unusual lord. I can't believe he treats the embedded so... Hey, I'm not supposed to call him that anymore, remember? Right, my fault. Old habits die hard. I think all this just brings you back to where we were. Yeah, it does. Okay. There's not much else to do in there then. What's in 1F then? Is that like underground? Oh my god, we're back here now. Storerooms? Jesus. Heavy treat, highly valuable medicine spread across uh, an area that restores 3,000 HP. Store room 2, what's in here? Hundred gold, nice. A happy bottle. Euphoric concoction that brings good luck when consumed, greatly increasing the battle chain bonus gauge. Let's go check the library as well and see 
Maybe there's a goodie in there. I always find it so soothing to visit this courtyard. So it turns out it was some of the Danans working for this place to put it together. They do good work. They've got little fishies and everything. Wow, what is this place? The shelves here are filled with books. Not just random books either, there are tons of Dana ones too. And while I get that you're excited, but we've more important things to worry about right now. Yeah, you're right, sorry. An omelette recipe. Two thousand four hundred and fifty one days left. 2,450 days left. It's the diary of a Renan who counted down the days to the crown contest. More orange gel. What are they doing? Hate to bother you, but would it be possible for you to help in my studies? I mean, a lot of you did. Why, well, certainly I'm more than happy to help with Lord Dolim's efforts to spread education to the underprivileged. After all, a more educated populace makes a richer realm in more ways than one, and that includes the Denons. Thanks so much, I'll do my best to make the most of this opportunity Lord da Dolahim has given us. There are books about the arts of torture. What are these black splotches on the cover? Working slaves to the bone while maintaining productivity. Uh-oh. Now we're starting to piece it together. These are thick astral energy uh, research tomes. So hard to read. They can put you to sleep. Ooh. The Fashionista's Guide to Lenigus Attire and Armor. The Joys of Fine Liquor, a compendium on Menensian breweries. An illustrated guide to Zoogles raising and breathing. It's amazing to watch these children grow up. They won't even think twice about who's Renan and who's Denon when they're adults. It's because you're such a great teacher, miss. Look at you, I can't believe you already know how to flatter someone so well. Miss, there's something I don't get. Me too. Alright, alright, one at a time now, children. Curie... Curie... Curios and you finding gems in the rough. We must check all the bookshelves. An introduction to the government of Lenegas. A swordsmanship book with a slashed cover. Did the reader get mad at the book or use it in a fight? A chronolo chronology of the crown contest. Practical astral arts theories and applications. Jokes unfit for dinner party. Even Renans enjoy their fair share of low bro humor, it seems. What you think about eating soon? Really, I'm not hungry myself. Don't make me say it again. On Danon customs. Okay, I think we've read everything in here. Did we? Yeah, we did. Oh wait, we didn't. Ashal Arts for Winners, your surefire guide to claiming a lordship. Oh yeah, we did. We saw all this. Okay.
Will they let us back into the kitchen now? They will. Why the fuck is there an owl in the kitchen? That's funny. It was a crown. Thank you, Mr. L. Out in the staff waiting room as well. We are. We're the staff now. Peach gel. Milk. That it? That's all that's in there. And then we're back to the entrance plaza, okay. Do you really think we should trust uh, accommodations from a Renan Lord? How do we know it's safe? Like we have any other choice, we can't go out and set up camp outside of town at this hour. Honestly, I still take that over staying here. What if they try to kill us in our sleep? I doubt that's the case. His best chance uh, to kill us would have been back at the palace. His true intentions aside, for now at least we're in his good books. So he probably shouldn't test his patience, let's find that in and check. And check in. Well, I don't think she owns in his good books, I mean she fucking tried to kill him. I mean, the rest of us didn't do anything, she fucking tried to shoot him. Interesting, all we ever got was a tattered blanket, a rock hard bed and well past its prime food. What are you talking about? What we got for our slaves labor back in Calaglia, as you can tell, wasn't much at all. Here the Danans get the same basic amenities, but the quality is way better than anything we were ever given. Apparently they even get more time off to do what they want, if I'm being honest, I'm not sure how to take all this in. Could it be that things were simply harsher in Calaglia compared to everywhere else? It was the same in Sislodia too, our buildings and clothing were equipped to handle the cold but that was the only difference. Working the floodlights was a form of punishment, so we didn't really get rewarded for anything. It could be a sign to fix food or make daily necessities too, but, well... Uh, there wasn't much in the way of compensation for any of that, so I'd say that Sislodi and Calagli were both pretty awful. Then Elder Menencia really is unusual. To say the least, hell, I might even go as far to say it's all crazy. The fact that Ren... Uh, remains that Denons aren't free here. No matter how happy they look, they're still slaves. I don't even know what I think right now. This is all way too much to deal with. It's giving me a headache. Lord Dohalim. So that was Lord Dohalim, huh? He sure is something definitely not like the other lords we've met up until now. At first he sounded like just some snobby royal, but he immediately shut down Shion's surprise attack. He's tougher than he looks. Definitely, after all, he's a lord for a reason. 
The food is pretty damn good too. Why are you two complimenting him? You just said it yourself, Alf, and he's a Renan Lord. Yeah, but he didn't act hostile towards us. You're reading him wrong, he's acting indifferent. He's attempting to keep some distance between himself and everyone else, it's obvious. What are we going to do then? Vincent seems to be legit peaceful. Are we going to just do what he says and leave things be? Not entirely sure for now. I think it would be best for us to rest at the inn. Think about our options. Oh, it's night time now. So even though the Danans are still technically slaves here, they aren't being opposed. Or oh, oppressed. If Laglia hadn't been like this, would we have been content? Would there have been any reason to stand and fight? Let's head to the inn. Up ahead you'll find grounds of Ortelina Palace, the manor of Lord Dolan. Free to go near it if you like, but please mind your manners. I'm pretty sure we've talked with everyone here now. Oh, he has more stuff to say. I remember you. Do you need anything? What is this place? This is Vicent, capital of El de Manencia. Beautiful, verdant, peaceful city full of life. The most beautiful landmark is Otelina Palace, the manor of Lord Doem. Uh, his policies have ensured that we can live our lives free of oppression. Do you need anything else? Seems pretty bustling here. Sure is, it's what that sets the city apart. We're still technically slaves, but we get paid fairly for our work. So everybody's happy to work. The marketplace is booming and worries about where food or lodgings come from or anything of the past. It's all the result of Lord Doem's reforms. Now then, do you need anything else? Is there anywhere we can rest? Ah, you must be tired after so long on the road. Go up the stairs behind me, you'll find an in the inn. They've always got a bar a barker girl out front, so it shouldn't be should be hard to miss. The beds are there are great, so I highly recommend staying there at least once. Thanks, mate. Welcome, fair travellers. Lord Dolim's retainer told us to expect you. It is an honour for you to stay with us after travelling such great lengths. Please make sure yourselves make yourselves comfortable. This is better than I expected. The room, it's nice. Oh yeah, it is pretty nice. What's wrong with law? Should I pass out? It's weird, I felt strange ever since I arrived here. Can't seem to shake it. Maybe it's something to do about this place. It was the food they gave you. They poisoned you. You're just tired. I'm feeling pretty sluggish myself. You too? Seriously, you too? A word for the wise. Our work here is far from over. Get yourselves together. Sorry, well, I need to call it a day. Let's meet back here tomorrow morning and see where things go from there. Sounds good. Keep an eye out for anything strange, okay? Still don't know how safe the place really is. Are you two feeling any better? Yeah, a good night's sleep seems to have done the trick. Wonder why we felt so out of it, do you think? Yeah, it was the food you ate. You don't think they slipped something into our food, do you? That must be it. If they were making an attempt on our lives, we'd know it by now. Though on the other hand, they could be warning us off. Come to think of it, you didn't eat anything at the meal, Rinwell. But you're starving. I made myself something later. You missed out on some mighty fancy grub they served yesterday. What, I give the enemy a chance to poison me too? Are you crazy? 
What's the big deal? She only ate it too, remember? And we both tried the same stuff. Well, maybe they laced with poison. That's only harmful to Danans. Hmm? That's enough, Rinwell. Hmm. A cat? Where'd it come from? Something on its collar. Hold on a sec. I think it's trying to lead us somewhere. I'm gonna follow it. Where are you going? Ah, there it is. Stay close, we're gonna lose it. What's gotten into you, Law? This might be the lead we've been waiting for. Seriously? Yeah, some people train animals to act as messengers, they don't attract attention, see? And do you think that someone might be using that cat to reach out and send a message or something? Could be wrong, but it's possible. I'm impressed, I would never have thought of that. I should know, we used to use them in Sislodia. The Black Cat's Master. So that black cat, do you think it works for someone? Sure it does, it wouldn't try to lead us around like that if somebody didn't train it to. I wouldn't know, I've never had one myself. If I did, I'd probably try to eat poor Hoodle. <laughs> I wonder who they are though, I doubt this is Dolim's work. Yeah, he has no reason to do this, although we can't rule out it might be one of his lackeys either. I think one of his subordinates is up to something. The Dolim guy is pretty unusual character for Renan, let alone for a lord. It's hard for me to imagine that they all agree with what he's doing, maybe one of them uh, plucked up the courage to go rogue. Well, let's head further and I'd like to figure out at least one of the mysteries of this place. Or oh, it's a trap. He's leading us to our death. Oh, he's gonna bring us to, uh... This area. Do you think it's trying to lead us? Who knows, we should hurry, we don't want to lose it. Whoever came up with it is pretty damn clever. Yeah, it just looks like an ordinary cute cat. We lost sight of the cat. After the chase, he's out of sun, there's got to be something up ahead. Oh, we're in the forest. I get that underground forests aren't exactly something you see every day, but I really could have done without any zoogles running around. You said that I get the city up top surrounded by castle walls, but now I won't be able to sleep easy knowing. They're lurking underneath. You have nothing to fear. Zoogles work for the Renans. Might be strays out here, but the other Zoogles won't let them get close. Using Zoogles to keep watch over their own kind, huh? That would explain why we're not seeing any guards. Yeah, which makes it that much easier for someone to hide around here, too. An innocent brush. What? 
Sorry, she on my foot slipped. Are you all right? Should be asking you. What am I saying? Of course you're okay. It's easy to forget sometimes. If anybody else had been in your place, they'd be in howling right about now. Oh, right. You mean your thorns? Yeah, I'm no worse for wear over here. Again, sorry for brushing you like that without warning. Well, just be careful. Wait, what did he do? He kicked her? He tried touching her or something? I don't know. Forget it, it's nothing. I'm sorry to bother you. Okay. What's with those two? Hey, Janine. How are you? How's Friday? How's the streams? We have to fight these. A forest roper. Streams are meh. Friday is good. That's good to hear. What are you playing at the moment? Are you done with Saints Row? I'm good though. Actually enjoying this game a good bit as well. I've also um I've now finished Gears uh, Judgment and Gears of War 1. Like last week or whatever. Now I'm doing the Halos as well. Persona 5, is it good? I heard that game was amazing. Well, it's amazing if you're into that sort of game, I guess. Oh, this one's nearly dead as well. Gears Judgment is dumb while I like it. Yeah, I actually enjoyed it. Like, I hadn't played um, the Gears games in literally years. Like, um, And that was the first time I played Judgment. But I liked how it kind of split the game up into like smaller little kind of chapters or acts. Like they were telling the story to the whoever it was. The sergeant or the general guy. Can't remember his name now, but you know, they were on the trial and stuff. The reason trees around here are so big is because of astral energy, right? It's possible, but give them enough time and trees can get big on their own without any extra help. This looks more fun than I thought. Yeah, honestly it is. The combat is actually very fun. I tried Tales of uh, Berseria before. I didn't get that far in it, but this one, yeah, it's actually a combat is very fun. <laughs> they 
They randomly learn new skills as well. Uh, I don't, still don't know why. I thought it was because they're leveling up, but it's not. They just like randomly get a new skill out of nowhere. I don't understand it, but anyway. I think there's a demo as well uh, on the PS4, probably on the Xbox as well. Pretty sure it is on the Xbox if you want to try it. Give the demo a go. You just sometimes have to get used to the same song being played in every battle. It changes sometimes, but for the most part it's just this one song. Pretty cool though. I really like some of the finishers. I think they look really cool. I even know where I'm going in here. Wait, that's where I was, no? Bye Janine, thanks for stopping by. Have fun with Persona, and I'll probably watch your stream again whenever you're on. Bye bye. Oh, everyone's level 18 now. Oh, Rittenwell just got level 18 as well. Oh, we're going the right way anyway. At least. This is the wrong way, is it? Well, maybe it all leads back to the same area anyway. What's up here? Oh shit! Boomies and apes. Ow. Wait, so there was nothing really up here except for the enemies? 
Oh, there's a chest. Topaz Cloak. Oh. We were going the right way. It was back up here, right? No, it's the outer level is where we need to be going maybe it's up here I don't know we're on the right track but oh, there we go I know no we're on the right way where we are we are we are That one's cool, I like that one a lot. We didn't get leveled up. But she owns me leveled up. Or so they belong to people, not in days and not now, only stop for us when you're absolutely sure it's safe. We can manage the ranch from here as well. Beef, pork and chicken. Let's put two pigs this time in there. And a cow. If we make a new weapon. Oh, we can. Oh, we can't make anything for law yet. Sense a mysterious power. Touch it. Our character's HP and CP is recovered. I think I'll leave it here for this part and then in the next one we'll go and find out what's uh, what's in the forest beyond this point. So yeah, I'll leave it there for now and uh, bye bye.